Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on the channel. And in today's video, we're going to take a break from the NASCAR stuff for just a minute here and take a look at another new 2024 release, that being Space Creature Lightning McQueen. Yeah, this guy's not really new anymore since he came out in like March, but <laughs> who's keeping track? So, I never actually have seen this guy in a store. I had to buy this guy off eBay a few months back and just didn't get around to doing a video on him until now, so... I figured why not? He's apparently showing up in one of the more recent half cases. I forget which one at the moment, but... Yeah, he should maybe hopefully show up at Walmart, assuming Walmart gets in new product. I haven't seen anything past E. <laughs> oh, this line is in shambles right now. But, anyway, let's disregard all that and get back into the Space Creature McQueen himself. So, he of course appeared in the Legend episode of Cars on the Road, the one with the Cryptid Busters. And, you know, he's just McQueen under a white tarp with two black cutouts for eyes to mimic, you know, an alien. It, it looks right. It's, it's kind of cute, homemade costume. But it scares the absolute shit out of the Cryptid Busters anyway. <laughs> like, I, I cannot wrap my head around that. Three professional cryptid buster get scared by McQueen under a tarp. That is funny. <laughs> but either way, this diecast has a sneaky surprise under it. Because let's face it, we can't really talk about the tarp too much because it's just a white piece of plastic with the eyes. So, boink, the tarp comes off to reveal cryptid buster lightning McQueen without the gear. That's really cool. They could have just seeped out and given us like a normal on the road McQueen under this tarp, but they went the extra mile. I appreciate that. And it gives us a diecast to look at. So let's take a look at his expression. He's kind of, you know, nervous. Maybe he's nervous that this whole plan isn't going to work, but you know, because they are professional cryptid busters, why would they be scared by him in the seat? But you know, <laughs> you know, he's got that nervous expression. You know, he's got his headlights typically, uh, Radiator Springs logo on the hood on the road bit on the nose, but, you know, it is what it is. And then we got the Cryptid Buster logo on the side here. Let's get a zoom in on that. Ah, uh, it's a little blurry, but we can make it out. Kind of. My eyesight's pretty bad, but maybe y'all can read that. Um, it's, of course, the Cryptid Buster logo. Nothing too much to it. And he's got some nice camo pattern on the side here. Very unique camo color pattern here. Don't often see, like, orange, this brown thrown into camo like that. And then he's got his gas cap here, light year text on his tires with red rims, typical McQueen stuff. Nothing on the roof or spoiler. And on the back, he's got the taillights, the 95 there, another taillight. And, of course, the sp splitter braces are gray. And the right side is mostly the same as the left with a bit of a difference in the camo. So, that about sums up him himself. Now, how about some comparisons? So, let's take a look at some other McQueens that have some fun accessories, like Slow Lime Lightning McQueen. These two are both from Cars on the Road. Now, I think this is removable, but I haven't been able to get it off. So, we're just going to kind of compare them, you know, as they are. Two completely different McQueen variants, but they both have something draped on top of them. This one is more in line with this one, Cupcake Lightning McQueen. You know, the insanely expensive, ludicrously rare Lightning McQueen now for some reason, even though it's just a normal Rusty's McQueen with a tarp on it. I don't understand it, but what is pretty cool is that we can take the accessories off of both of these guys. Cupcake requires a bit more oomph to get off, and then we can just plop that right onto him right there. And we can cover Rusty's McQueen with this tarp to do a little uh, switcheroo, a little gotcha <laughs> moment there. So that's pretty fun. Uh, I love that we can interlock these two accessories. So let's go ahead and remove the $150 McQueen from the frame. And finally, we'll leave the tarp off for this one. Let's bring in normal Cryptid Buster Lightning McQueen. These two look real nice together. They've got different expressions. And, you know, the differences are, you know, honestly, even the camo pattern has a bit of a different color to it on both of them. That's, that's pretty cool. Honestly, this eye cast is severely underrated 
And I would definitely say get it, even if you have, you know, Cryptid Buster Lightning McQueen already in your collection or what have you. I'd say it's definitely worth the pickup, especially since he's apparently getting re-released in one of the half cases. So, happy hunting if you haven't seen this guy already, and I will catch y'all in the next video. Bye!